All right, let's get to it. Once we mess up everyone's properties and ruin their decorations, we'll blame it all on the Petersons. At least that's what we'll tell them. I'm still not too thrilled about this. Don't you think this is going too far? Who cares if it's too far? This thing is happening tonight, and we're going to make sure they spend 15 more hours of community service. They'll keep on doing it until the end of next year. Fine. But if we get caught, you're on your own, and I won't be bailing you out. Whatever. Let's just get to it. That was such a great party. Oh, and Poppy, Larry, thanks for joining us for Trick or Treating. And you too, Carly. Of course, Stan. Happy to be with you guys. Well, let's get going. All that candy's not gonna get itself. Oh no. Trick or Treating's been cancelled. What? Why? There's been some sightings houses being egged, Halloween decorations being ruined, candy being stolen, and lots of unhappy children. And apparently everyone must be blaming the Petersons for the job. But that's impossible. Yeah, you guys were here with us at the party. So we know that's not true. I say someone must be framing you guys for the crime. Looks like it. We need to get to the bottom of this. Come on, we better get going. Ha ha, it's trending. Everyone is turning out against those Petersons. Yay well, it won't be long until they figure out it was us. As I told you, they'll never catch us. And stop giving me that look, this is awesome. Awesome for you. I didn't even want to do this. All I wanted to do was go trick or treating, and going to the party. But now thanks to this thing we did, the party is over, Halloween is ruined, and it's all because of you and me. Because of me. You can thank me now. Now shut up, and let's go inside to celebrate our victory. Those boys will be doing community service in no time. Victory. I'll give you victory. <laughs>